The task is to demonstrate tending a conveyor oven to bake bagels. This lab setup simulates a baker who has just unpacked and installed a robot manipulator and connect cameras into her baking area. The robot arm used here is a UR5, but it could be any other arm, for example, the AVV120. All demonstrations will be performed in a virtual environment using a touch interface. The baker wants the system to learn three principal concepts. First, bagels are picked from the table and placed in an unoccupied location on the conveyor load area. The robot should not load any bagels when there are no free spaces available. Secondly, bagels are picked up from the conveyor unload area. The plain bagels are packed into rows on one tray and the berry bagels are packed onto a second tray. The project draws on four technology areas under development in the Baker Group. Firstly, an interactive touch-based UI running on the Surface tablet. Secondly, generalization of demonstrated examples using program synthesis. Thirdly, machine learned image detectors and classifiers. The glue binding it together is the Microsoft Robotic Runtime System. Baker starts the demonstration by capturing an image of the physical workspace. The bagels are placed in the physical environment and a new image captured. This allows objects to be segmented using background subtraction as manipulable objects, which can be dragged in the virtual scene to demonstrate desired actions. The next step is for the baker to demarcate regions of interest. The first region indicated is the pickup rectangle at the exit of the oven. Then grids are added to indicate where the baked bagels should be moved and arranged in rows. One grid is for the berry bagels and the other for the plain bagels. Similarly, regions on the oven load side are drawn. The baker determined that only two bagels can fit at the input of the conveyor and so drew a 1 by 2 grid. To indicate priority, the unload tasks are demonstrated first. Virtual bagels are added to the scene. By dragging bagels, the baker demonstrates that plain bagels should be unloaded onto one of the grids and the berry bagel goes to the other. Finally, the load subtask is demonstrated by dragging bagels onto the grid at the oven entrance. The learned program can be validated in the virtual environment. The scene is manually rearranged and extra virtual bagels added to check generalization. Tapping the Try Program button validates the desired behaviors. The demonstrations are fed to a program synthesis component which generates a PowerShell script PowerShell is an extensible Windows scripting environment popular in the IT community. At the top of the script, the grids and regions defined by the demonstrations appear as declarations. Since all regions are rectangles, they are fully defined by three corners. An infinite loop encapsulates the demonstrated concepts. The script leverages the Microsoft robotic event-driven runtime. One of three actions is performed when the camera-driven object detectors observe a bagel within a load or unload workspace. Note the order of the action fixes a priority order. For example, the first action checks if there is a berry candidate in rect area 5, which corresponds to the exit area of the oven. When the check succeeds, the runtime directs the robot to pick the bagel and place it at the first unoccupied cell in grid area 3. Unoccupied cells are determined by running hit tests of all currently detected bagels in the scene against the geometry of the grid cells. Failures are handled using PowerShell's exception handling. The highlighted code illustrates handling the situation where there is no room in the oven to add a picked bagel. In this project, the handler was added manually, but the goal is to add handlers by demonstration. Driving overall execution are detectors running on the IR and depth images from the Kinect cameras. The output from the detectors are probabilistic estimates of the bagel poses in the scene. The end user must be able to customize the detector for their own particular object. This is achieved using machine learned detectors. Training data is automatically collected by having the baker place bagels at an initial location. The system then repeatedly moves the bagels to random locations in the work areas that were demarcated earlier. After relocating the bagel, camera images are collected together with object pose labels inferred from the robot. All components are now trained and the robot is ready to tend the bagel oven. Initially, there are no bagels to unload, so those in the load areas are picked up and placed in the oven entrance. 
When there is no free space on the conveyor, a thick bagel is replaced at its original location. After space has been freed, the system continues to load bagels. Similarly, bagels exiting the oven in the unload area are picked up. The berry bagels are arranged on one tray and the plain bagels on the other. The baker noticed that the bagels need to fully clear the oven exit to avoid a collision between the robot and the oven, and so drew the pickup region a safe distance from the oven exit. When there are bagels in both the load and unload regions, the generated script favors unloading the oven before restocking the input. Currently, drop bagels are not explicitly handled. Some recovery is built into the event-driven framework as the detectors will not distinguish between previously dropped and other bagels in the picked area.